What is up guys, Ryan Rigg, the host of your show, Fridays with Fell. Good morning, it is Friday. What? Where is everything? Where is all my stuff? Where's my desk and my TV, my electronics? It's all gone, guys. It's all gone. I'm selling it all. The reason is I am moving on. Um, I'm not going to be doing any YouTube videos anymore. I'm going to be actually taking down all of my channels and doing something else in life. Um, I know this may come as a disappointment to a lot of you. You're probably like, oh my gosh, no, I'm just joking, guys. We're not going to do that. We're not going to do that at all. The reason is 50 plus thousand of you amazing people have subscribed to this channel. I could never, and I would never, turn my backs on you guys. So how are you? Good morning. Just want to have fun with you. I'm actually up in my bedroom tonight, um, or today. The reason is I just wanted to do something different. Um, as you'll see by the end of the episode, it was definitely different. Uh, but more or less today's episode, I know we always talk about so many different things and products and tech, and I remember reflecting back on this uh, show and how it started was just me one-on-one -on -one with the camera, sitting on my couch, just talking about whatever came to mind. It was kind of like a vlog, and it grew into so much more than that uh, through your guys' feedback. I mean, your comments have made Fridays with Fell what it is, you know, with backdrops and products and I'm just trying to always give you guys the best show possible and today I wanted to do something different. I actually wanted to talk to you guys um, kind of like we talk on the vlog channel but I just wanted to talk to you. I wanted to hear from you guys. I wanted to you know see life through your eyes. I wanted to get inside your head and let me know what you're thinking. What are your thoughts you know on this channel? You know what are some things that you would like to see me do on this channel? Would you like to see me bring more gameplays back to this channel instead of them all being on Gaming for Grandpa? Would you like to see more products? Uh, would you like to see me on the camera more? Would you like to see different types of shows? Would there be different types of products or different ideas, concepts that we could talk about? That's what today's episode is all about. I wanna hear from you guys. Um, for example, almost 53,000 subscribers on the channel, which is a, just a huge milestone. I never thought something like this could happen, let alone a year ago, uh, roughly, it was about 368 days ago, I started a vlog channel. It was just vlog only. It's a year strong and almost a million views. And with this channel turning over 6 million views just this week, I was like, wow, this is absolutely amazing. You guys have you know, been totally supportive and have been behind me, uh, but it's just, just so surreal to see it. So that's why I wanted to talk to you guys and just ask you, what, what's going on in your mind, you know, in terms of YouTube and the channel? Um, for example... You know, when I produce a new video, I get that those videos may not appeal to everybody. For example, the new Keurig coffee maker. I get everybody doesn't drink coffee. But with the sheer amount of subscribers alone on the channel, I would think that the second when a video is released on the channel that we'd have an inconsiderable amount uh, more of views than we do. Um, and I put a lot of time into these videos and I know it's, you know, a product that's been out for a year. It may not appeal to everybody. Nobody may not even really have an interest in that and they don't want to watch it. I understand that. But I'm just trying to gauge and understand, you know, I take for example, like I know the Xbox One PS4 giveaway just by the sheer title is going to get a lot of views. But I'd look at an example like that video, 14,000 views. A recent Fridays with Fell, 3,000 views. Uh, some time lapses, a couple thousand views. As I look on the channel, you know, each video will, might get about 1,000 or 2,000 views, maybe 3,000 if we're lucky. Those rare fewities like the Xbox One surprise for my son a year ago, over a million views. Um, so it's always interesting, you know, what will get viewed and what won't. Um, and having all of these subscribers is just amazing, but I also want to make sure that the subscribers we have are watching the content, you know, that they enjoy what I put out. And if, and if they don't, I, that's this is the time I need to hear from you. So I can kind of, you know, react to you guys. And moving forward, what, what should we do? I know that I've kind of put myself on this you know, isolated island of being the guy that does all these giveaways, and I'm starting to wonder now, I love to give back to you guys, um, but I know a lot of people um, could care less about me, my channel, my son, or what I'm doing in my life, and are only concerned for the giveaways, and I get that. Um, I did the giveaways twofold. Primarily is for you guys to give back to you, the ones that really support the channel, but also it's great from a marketing standpoint. It helps bring in potentially new uh, subscribers, you know, which we've received a lot of them. I just need to convert a way to take these new subscribers and convert them into actual views, you know? So that's why, again, I'm reaching out to you guys. I know a lot of people 
may thumbs down the video and we get quite a few thumbs down, but there's never any negative feedback. There's a few comments that are just so bizarre and obscure and just full of hatred and those could be the thumbs down, but most of them don't come with any type of feedback. So I don't know what was there to dislike about the video. Obviously I know I'm biased, but you know, most people just say, oh, great video or great video. But the recent videos, I've noticed the comments are all about the giveaway. Now, granted, the people loyal to the channel aren't commenting about a giveaway on a new tech video. I get that. But it makes me wonder, you know. Um, I put a lot of time and a lot of effort into this. Um, you guys know it's my passion. I would make these videos anyway. Um, but it's sometimes disheartening, you know, to see, for example, that Keurig. It was about two and a half hours of filming roughly three hours of editing and about an hour or two to process on YouTube. So about five, six hours of my day spent, and I would do that anyway. I love to make videos and I love to make each new video. I try to make the next one better than the one before. You know, I always try something different with different camera angles or just, you know, a more consolidated review or more concise uh, information. That's what I try to deliver. Um, and then when they don't get a lot of views, it just makes me wonder. It doesn't make me upset. I'm not upset or mad. I'm just talking to you guys. You guys know me by now because I'm Ryan Rigg, the host of your show. This is what I do. But I just want to hear from you guys. You know, I, I read all your comments. I value your feedback. Uh, we can't do this. I can't do this without you guys. So I thought, well, the next step to 100,000, which we would love to see is great. But what type of great content can we bring along the way? What other things would you guys like to see? I know somebody had talked to me on Instagram about a car care series because you guys know I've done a, quite a few videos on the channel about vehicles, uh, but like a car care, you know, what's the proper chemicals and products to use when washing and waxing your car? I thought that was an amazing question. So shout out to you, my man on Instagram for that. And I was actually in, in my mindset was working on uh, just kind of a small video series, you know, just steps to really take your dirty car and make it showroom quality for not a lot of dollars. You know, you don't have to go out there and buy the best of the best products. You just need to know what you're doing with whatever product you have. And I felt I could help bridge the gaps. That was a great idea for a new uh, video series, new content. You know, it's something different for the channel. So like we talked about last week, I'd challenge you guys in the week before to go out and watch some of the other videos, watch some of the other playlists. I'm actually going to be going through the channel um, and organizing some new playlists so that they're uh, a little more consolidated and more updated. There were quite a few of them, so I kind of want to not shrink them down, but just maybe broaden the categories that they're in so they can maybe appeal to more people. I've done, I think there's over 600 something videos on this channel, guys. So like I said, the channel has been open since 2009. So six years worth of videos, granted most of which occurred within the last three to four years, the most of them. So if you'd like to go back and help me out and watch some of those videos, I, I encourage you to, because I think that will A, help you to help me figure out what we can do better on the channel. Not that we're doing bad, I just, I want something bigger and better. I want to drop a new video and get thousands of views right away. So I wanna connect with the subscribers we have and not just for the cool stuff that I'm gonna give away. I'm gonna give that stuff away anyway, regardless because there's a lot of people out there that would are just happy to receive it. And I love to make people happy. I love to make people smile. And I just love to help the next guy. You know, I like to share that positivity. So when, you know, we start taking negative, uh, negative comments or hatred towards me or my son, it just becomes, well, hold on here. You know, you, you see other YouTubers, you know, that don't do giveaways. And there's nothing wrong with that. We give extraordinary giveaways um, because I really value your guys' feedback your support, your loyalty to the channel. You guys buy our t-shirts, you buy the wristbands. Um, and I wanna make all of that more special for you. So if there's other merchandise or other things you'd like to see on a t-shirt, please let me know in the comments below. If there is new video ideas you would like to see, please, I'm begging you, let me know in the comments below. Um, and I'm actually gonna open up the comment form. I mean, I know there's gonna be some negativity in there and I am actually welcoming all of it. I will call um, my positive spin on negativity is called constructive criticism. And if you can't take that well, you will never prevail in the YouTube space. YouTube is full of criticism. You just have to take the good from the bad. Um, and that's what I try to do. I try to find the positive every single time in all of this negativity. So, for example, I caught about seven different people that went on my son's vlog last week just they said 
the worst things ever. They might make a top 10 favorite comments YouTube video like I do on my vlog channel. But then I see them either before or right after that had entered the giveaway of Fast Electronic and Loud for the Xbox One and PS4 giveaway. And I, I automatically spam those comments. Why? It's my giveaway. I know it's random, but I, it, I could not in my heart allow that person to win after what they just said. So you can call that what you want. You, know, you can say what you want, but we're going to just spam and delete your comments because we are full of positivity. You guys, um, the ones that make those comments, I'm not sure what's wrong in your life. Um, I hope that that situation improves and I hope tomorrow you can wake up uh, more positive than you were today because some of your comments are funny. You know, I think if I shared them with like your parents um, and school administrators, you guys would probably find yourself in trouble. A few of them have been borderline, you know, cyber harassment, cyber bullying, whatever you wanna call it, which walks a very fine line with the laws that we have here in Illinois. Um, I've documented uh, people's IP addresses for things that they've done um, to our account, you know, try to hack my internet here when I'm streaming. Um, and I was also gonna do some more live streaming. I thought maybe next week um, at just 8 a.m. I would start a live show. I, the webcam, I would use like a 1080p webcam, but we could do a live show uh, next Friday. I thought that might be cool, something fun and different. Um, and it'd be live, you know, kind of like the news or, you know, sports would be. So. Like I said, guys, I'm really, really desperate here for your feedback. Any comments, questions, concerns you have about the channel, how we can grow, what type of content I'd like, I just would like to see, the subscribers are growing great. I'd like to see more views. I'd like to see more engagement. So if there's something that I'm doing wrong, please, please, as much as you think it may hurt my feelings, it might, but I promise you at the end, I'm gonna smile and be thankful that you took the time to A, listen to me, B, acknowledge my request, C, that you watch this video, and D, that you actually left a comment um, that was worthwhile uh, criticism for me, constructive criticism, good or the bad. So really appreciate it, guys. So if you could really do me that favor this time, I know I always ask a lot of you, and I sometimes feel bad because I ask for uh, so much from you guys, but if you could really help me out with trying to figure out this channel and if I'm doing the right thing and if I need to be doing something different, I really value your feedback today. So um, I hope you guys enjoy your day, enjoy your weekend. Please share with me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, the comments on this video, where have you? All my social media links are listed below, but please share anywhere you like, comments, questions, concerns about me, the channel, primarily the channel. You can ask me something about myself, I guess, but the focus here is really for you guys and the channel. What do you guys want from me and this channel? What would make this channel and Fast Electronic and Loud a better experience for you? What would bring more viewers to the channel? What would bring more subscribers to the channel? That's what I'm asking from you guys. And being there's 52 plus thousand of you, I expect to see 52,000 comments down below. I know that won't happen, but that would be awesome if it did. It would take me a lot of time to go through it, but I would value all of that feedback. So please, if you can, I'm asking you to do this one thing for me today. It doesn't have to be today. You could do it over the weekend. Take some time. Maybe you want to be the type to take some time and actually give me a really good, solid comment and you want some time to do that. I totally respect that because it's probably going to be really awesome feedback. So, but guys, it's just me, simple old me, Ryan Rigg from Springfield, Illinois, that loves to make YouTube videos. I have a passion for this. As you can tell, I have multiple channels. This is what I know. This is what I love. Um, I do know IT, I do know the world of networking. You guys know my background includes a master's degree um, and bachelor's degree in computer science. Graduated both of those with high honors from the University of Illinois uh, here in Springfield. And my passion yet still remains electronics, cars, making videos. Making videos is what makes, brings me the most joy, you know, besides other things in life, like my just life outside of camera, my son, my family, that brings me a lot of joy. But when you think about like work or in terms of hobbies or what really trips my trigger. Making videos has been my passion for a long time. I love to do this. In fact, I'm like amped afterwards to edit this and get the episode up so it's there right bright and early for you guys at 8 a.m. But if I could, please, let's try to get 2,000. I know it's a ridiculous, ambitious number, but let's try to get 2,000 likes on this video. That would let me know how much engagement I really actually have on my channel. In fact, I would like to see 3,000. I mean, 5,000 would be awesome. 5,000 likes would let me know that about 10% of the subscribers um, 
that we have on the channel watch the video. That would be an awesome goal. I think the reality is maybe one or two percent because I look at a lot of big YouTubers, they'll release a new video and I look at it in a week. For example, somebody might have, you know, two million subscribers and then after a week that video, maybe only a couple hundred thousand views. So when you do that by percentage, my percentage of views to subscribers isn't that bad. It's actually pretty great. So maybe all this fuss about today's show is really over nothing, but I really, like I said, value your feedback. So if I could, 5,000 likes on today's new video. Did he just say 5,000? Yeah, I did. Well, guys, I'm Ryan Rigg, the host of your show, Fridays with Fell. Bright and early, 8 a.m. every single Friday. I do it without fail because why? I love you guys. B, it's my passion. So if you did enjoy it, please smash the, the crap out of that like button. I never say that word and I probably shouldn't have smashed the crap. I guess it's all right, right? Eh, I don't know. So go ahead. We'll say it again. Smash the crap out of that like button for me, guys. I really do appreciate it. I'll be looking forward to reading your comments, but have a great weekend, guys. Coming up on the end of the month, so I'll probably be announcing the giveaway winner soon. So if you came here only for the giveaway winner announcement and you were disappointed, I'm sorry. You're doing it all wrong anyway. If you come here only for my giveaways, that's your choice, but you're gonna be missing out on a lot of other great stuff in my opinion. And in the opinion of others, they think it's pretty good stuff too. So 5,000 likes today on today's episode. But guys, Ryan Rigg, appreciate your time. It was a long one and we didn't even talk about a single product today. That was awesome. But like I said, please leave your feedback guys. Have a great weekend and we'll see you on another video or gameplay or episode or upload or live stream or whatever else crazy I decide to do next. But follow me on social media if you do that. And we'll see you guys. Have a great weekend. Thanks.